In the spring, the children had an opportunity to plan a mural for our school. We wanted the students to meet the artist and to have an opportunity to work with her prior to working on the wall. That's a dandelion. So it's a big sunflower. Well, it has seeds on the inside. With the older kids, what we did was we brought them in here and put long sheets of paper out on tables and had them work together on creating, actually, the images that would be put on the wall. So basically, each grade level had the opportunity to design the mural for our building. I took all of your drawings, and what I did was make a sketch of what our mural is going to look like. What you're going to do is send you the raindrops, okay? We tried to get every child to get the opportunity to either do some of the beginning drawings on the mural, in the, on the actual mural, or to have an opportunity to paint on it. We are one minute away from switching, so finish out your drawing. It was cool watching everybody have an opportunity to work on this mural. Nice job. From the little people to fifth graders to tall fifth graders, everybody had a chance to don a smock and grab a paintbrush and have a piece of this mural. It was really childlike. We allowed the kids to, to do their own images, their own images of the sun and their own images of flowers and animals. And then we actually took those images and put them on the wall. It just brightens up the building and makes a building a happy place. I mean, we're teaching children. It should be bright, it should be happy. And it builds a sense of community because this is theirs. I think it's a really valuable lesson for our children to learn to work together, to get along together, to grow together. It's something our kids created themselves. I think it's been great for kids' self-esteem. It's been great to build that sense of family and sense of community for our school. I wanted all the kids in this building, and even teachers too, we had some teachers that painted on it too, wanted them all to take part and to to have a sense of ownership in the work itself. The final product is awesome. It's cheerful, it's bright, it's happy. It just makes you smile when you walk down the hall now.